Hey guys, welcome to Atomic Training of the Weight. Um, what I'm planning to do is reboot this channel. So I'm trying to reboot this channel after like a year or so many years. I don't know, I've been away from YouTube so long. But um, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing a lot of stuff like uh, e-cigs or try to do mods. Mostly juices because that's what I can get my hands on. I'm not sponsored or anything, but I'm just buying it out of my own freaking pocket. Anyways, uh, today for you guys, I'm gonna do a, a mutation XS uh, build. So this tiny, this tiny bugger right here, upon this uh, Project Subum, I think, uh, Project Subum S S80, I think. Really good device. Let's, let's go ahead and have a look. Mmm, tasty. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not really good at builds at uh rda builds but i'm gonna try um and like usually i'm i'm usually just vaping on on right here u crown uh tanks uh my mvp3 so um yeah again i'm not sponsored or anything but i would like to <laughs> uh if you guys like what you guys see so subscribe and you know and all that kind shit. but anyways uh stay tuned hold on hold on, hold on. All right, so uh, welcome back. So right now I just fixed up my camera. Um, yeah, I know you see the shadow over here, but it's pretty funny because I'm using my phone camera, so it's like propped up on one of my stools. Anyways, uh, so right now we're gonna start the build. So this is, if you guys don't know what the Mutation XS is, uh, it's of course the RDA, it's pretty good. Pretty good RDA here, let's just see. If you can kind of zoom in on that, can you focus on that? What's up with this? There you go. It's a pretty good RDA. Really good. Nice firing. Of course, this is my build. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be rebuilding this build. Uh, yeah, fire's pretty good. Um, I don't know. I, I really don't know the technical terms for, uh, for like this type of build or whatever setup this is. But anyways, bear with me. Um, oh yeah, so this is what I use. I have this tin box. I have a bunch of tin boxes actually. Um, and this is for my vaping stuff. So I got e-juice, cotton, all the kind of stuff in here. So what we're gonna do right off the bat is I am gonna go ahead and get out my tools. And then let's start, let's start uh, taking this apart. Oh yeah, this jig is really awesome by UD or, uh, I don't know, UD? Some, I don't really know the, the words for them or whatnot. Hold on one moment. Here, pick this up before my dogs eat. There we go. Okay, let's move this back. Before my dogs eat this and get sick. Okay, so here we are. So this is a really good jig. I like this jig. Um, oh yeah, and then I'm also vaping uh, Poconos, Mountain Poconos uh, vape. So pretty good cotton candy. Okay, so let's go ahead. Uh, of course, you're gonna get one of these screwdrivers uh, when you're. I think it came with the with the RDA itself. Um, so let's let's go ahead and just take this apart. So yeah, so um, if you're gonna really. I kind of watch what I do. Um, I don't really do the the whole, you know, maintenance stuff. Like you know, some people want to clean their their RDA before they even try try something new. So I'm not like that. So it's just because I'll wash them later. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this off. We don't need these. So this is my old old coils okay okay so there's still juice around them but honestly i don't give a shit okay so i'm gonna go ahead and grab a canthal wire uh this one is a 28 gauge canthal wire single not twisted like how how the fancy guys are uh pretty much what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna take like about this much uh so hopefully i i can make this pretty good oh something's irritating my dogs right now and they're not liking it. So let's go ahead and cut two of these. 
We're gonna do a dual coil. Okay. All right, and then uh, for the wraps, I'm gonna do 2.5 point, 2 sounds good. 2.5 around four wraps, right? That sounds pretty good. Okay, so let's go ahead and screw this in. Make sure this is all tight. Yeah, all tight. Okay, my dogs are getting all irritated right now. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and have this in. So this is only my, like, I've only built, sorry about my dogs, <laughs> but I've only built, shh, hey, yeah, stop it, calm down. I only built a couple coils, so bear with me on this. Okay, so what I'm going to do is use this jig and go about four wraps. Three. Okay, so I'll compress nice and tight it. Okay. And that's about good. Like it's not it's not like full on high quality or whatnot, but rather than just wrapping it myself around around a piece of a, or around a screwdriver, you know, so it's not that bad. So I'm just gonna stick this into the hole. I was pretty surprised um because I always told myself I wasn't gonna get into RDAs, but for some reason now I don't know, I, I just find it addicting. It's very addicting. Okay, so I think that's about four. Yeah, four wraps. There you go. Okay, so I got two coils right here. Let's put this aside. I don't need those. I don't need those. <laughs> I don't need those. Okay, let's go ahead and put these coils, these leads into the, R the RDA itself. Pretty good coils actually, not bad. I've only been building this like a couple times, so it's not like I'm, I'm super pro at it. But you know what? You're never super pro at, at anything. You're always learning something new, so. Okay, let's go ahead and use this J because this is gonna ha help me kind of have it placed. Um, So for this mutation, excess, like I'm not really sure how it's supposed to be set like properly. Like where the coils are supposed to be but for some reason every time I, I tried building this I'm this in, every time it's every time I tried building this um, it always comes out pretty pretty good so you know basically it's just trial and error like you gotta like you do your research and stuff like I've been watching Mike vapes shout out to you Mike vapes you're the one that kind of helped me do this build it's just a little bit too far but uh, oh well. uh, so pretty much this is what I'm gonna do to the second one I'll pause and then uh, we'll come right back to it okay all right you guys welcome back um I just put on the second coil look at that I got some juice all over this some mud, uh, that's right so I just put on the second coil I didn't um, I didn't fire it or you know try to crimp it down yet so let's go ahead and try check it out Ooh, oh man, that's some hot coils. Let's drop this down a little bit. Um, I know I'm at 50. Uh, to be safe, uh, anytime whenever you're doing this, crimping your coils or whatnot, like you want to drop it down, uh, drop down the wattage so that it doesn't um, fool on, uh, I don't know what that term is called, but like, it doesn't fool on uh, snap or break. <laughs> Ooh, some nice coils. Wow, I'm glad with this build. I'm pretty glad about this build. It's a pretty good build. Just trying to fix it up a little bit. And let me try focusing for you guys. See, look, like, I'm not sure about, like, where the coils are actually supposed to set, are supposed to be set, like, in, for the vent holes and stuff like that. I know the juice wells and stuff, but, I don't know, that's, sorry with all the noise, though. But, yeah, that's the best I can get, and it's reading at a point, uh, right here. Oh, shit, I'm so <laughs> So, it's reading at, like, a point, uh, seven, a point five seven, I mean, so, it's pretty good 
Okay, uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and whip this up. I'm gonna pause and then uh, come back and well, well, it's kind of whipped up. Okay. Oh yeah, and by the way, um, for the wicking material, I'm using uh, of course organic cotton. Uh, this one is uh, premium wicking cotton by was this vape vape nine. I don't know, it's a 75. So I got this from eSiggity, so it's right down the store, uh, right down the road from my store. So shout out to eSiggity. You guys, good, good job. Oh, wow. It's okay. <laughs> All right, you guys, you're kind of back right now. Um, but yeah, uh, what I'm doing right now is I'm just finalizing the wicking. So right here, this is my, this is my, uh, my wicking for my RDA um, yeah I'm not super pro at this but you know hey this is this is the best that you're ever gonna get honestly from from me well I'm I'm just like I don't know everyday vapor I guess I'm getting into this so I'm trying to just pack on this uh, make sure that they're in the juice wheels yeah I'm just an everyday vapor so like, I know you could call me a careless vapor, but um, it's just that, you know, I know what's right from wrong for battery, battery safety. And, like, I know my mod is still on. This mod is still on while I'm working on this, but it's just to check my... Check the kind of, this is a little bit too short. But uh, honestly, I don't give a fuck because I'm going to build another one anyway. So this is my RDA. Let's go ahead and put some Poconos cotton candy on top. Put some of this on top. Yeah, so check out Pocono's uh, vapes. I heard about them through. Sorry, my phone is going off. I heard about them through uh, through Chris uh, over at um, Indoor Smokers. Um, I thought I would just give them a try, you know, like just try them out. But now I love them, and thanks for that half off uh, Indoor Smokers because. That was like very helpful, especially for a regular, a regular vapor like me, man. Is everything? I'm not sponsored or anything, and everything's just super expo um, expensive. Anyways, so this is uh, pretty much the RDA being wicked, everything uh, with some juice on it. I'm gonna go ahead and just fire it right now. So is that 30? Oh man, is that 34? Oh, that smells good. It smells really good. Okay. Let's put a little bit more. Um, I learned from Mike. Oh, oh, that was a nice one. I learned from Mike, uh, you know, how to how to put the juice, like my vapes. Um, he says like, oh yeah, just try juice it around the middle or something like that. And I guarantee the cotton is gonna pick it up and Woo, that was nice. Yeah, so let's go ahead and turn this up to 50. Let's just see how how she really tanks. So this is uh, 50 watts, 50 watts at 0 0.5, 0 0.58. Okay, let's go ahead. Dang. You like that? Woo, that's crazy. Okay, let's go away, uh, take you guys back from this camera, this view, and uh, let's try vape on this okay all right guys uh, so continuing this video right now um, I just finished my building this I show you guys my build uh, so I'm gonna go have a have a toe on it damn crisp like brand new fresh cotton oh man I love it Massive clouds too, like, <sighs> and this is a only this is only an 80 watt device and I'm at 50 watts, freaking flipping awesome. Anyways, again, I am rebooting this channel. Um, I'm gonna have some vape stuff on here, some fun stuff, uh, some movie reviews, trailer reviews, maybe um, reactions. I don't know anything. Um, also, probably sometime this week or next week, uh, if I have time to record videos or to make videos for you guys. Uh, yeah, um, I will be doing. Da, da, da. Oh, oh, something came in the mail. What is this? It smells really awesome. 
I think it's my example box for March. So I'm gonna go do a juice review or a juice uh, previews thing uh, next time we meet again. So I'm Tom Train at the weight. Shoots, bro. Don't forget subscribe, comment, I don't know, like, dislike. Just let me know how you guys like these videos. Anyways, all right, shoots, guys.